everybody, hope you're well. I'm back with Star Stable. So we gotta to speak to Professor Hayden again. So let's try. Can't take it while the horse back, okay. I'm okay being on the ground as long as I'm not too close to Alberta. Be alright. Alberta, talk to me. What is its weakness? Have you got eaten too many flies? I told you not to eat too oh, many on one go. Have you hurt yourself climbing a tree? <laughs> Dragoslava. What's happened? Alberta, she's had stomach cramps all night long. I've tried everything, but nothing seems to be helping. What if she's sick? What if she's my my little sweetie, my princess? Please tell me what's wrong with you. Perhaps you can take out Alberta and see- No, I don't want to. Ugh. I'm actually getting like heebie jeebies. And it's not even real. I'm not coping with this. Right. You don't see anything visibly wrong with Alberta. Ugh. Okay. Did you find anything? What are you expecting? Why would you, she tell you what's wrong with a wrong and not me? Hmm? I don't know. No! Sweetness, don't cry. I'm here, princess. Here's your blanket, little one. Dragoslava, Alberta isn't feeling well, so I think you should go. Hmm. You've got an idea, you say? If we should take Alberta to a vet? Hmm. Well, that wasn't a stupid... Well, that wasn't a stupid idea. Hmm. Sweetie, what do you say? Shall we try going to Crescent Moon Village and see Camilla? Hey, hey, Alberta. Easy now. No need to bite. I'm not going to pick you up. We can't be here, though, so maybe I need to go. Okay, okay. Of course I won't leave you, Angel. I'll stay with you right here. I promise I won't leave you. You want to ride and fetch the vet? You say, hmm? Oh, oh you're incredibly helpful, aren't you? Hmm. Camilla Turnstone is the name you're looking for in Crescent Moon Village. She's known... It's Alberta Wells. She's been seeing her since she was little. If anyone knows what's wrong, it'll be her. Okay, so we need to go find the vet. I'm not sure where the vet is, actually. I don't think I've seen the vet here before. Oh, there she is. Camilla Turnstone. Hello there. Oh, take it easy, sweetheart. Breathe. Ha something happened. How did I know something's wrong? Little sweetheart, I've worked for many years as a chemist and a vet in what's known today as Old Hillcrest. Of course I can tell something's happened. Sorry, but who did you say you were? Dragoslava, nice to meet you. My name's C Camilla Turnstone. What can I do for you, newest friend? Oh no, that doesn't sound good at all, Dragoslava. That really does sound rather serious. Excellent that you managed to make it here so quickly. It could well be an abdominal aortic aneurysm. Uh, Coli coli colicitis? Or if you're really out of luck, it could be mesoteric is him me uh, I don't know anymore. <laughs> Sorry, you don't need to know what all of that means. I'll hurry out to the professor right away. Thanks, but I know where the camp uh, he camps in the swamp, so you don't need to show me. If you'd like to help me though, you could ride to the cauldron and gather seed pods from a helicondia sea plant, or at least it belongs to the plant family of plants. I'm sorry, in regular for your vacant, it's called a green lobster claw plant, and it's quite uncommon. I've only seen it growing in the cauldron. The plant can usually help erase most stomach and intestinal problems, and I'm sure it can work for Alberta, at least until I find out what's really wrong with her. Could you ride out to the cauldron and gather the fruit from the green lobster claw? It grows inside the, s the seed pods. Thanks, Dr. Savile. I'll meet you at Hedden's camp soon. I've never been to the cauldron before, so... I suppose we will figure out where we need to go. It looks like it is in this direction. This looks like it's it. It's going to be too easy to get down there though. Wow. This is pretty spectacular. I think this is okay to run down. Yep, it is. I think we can sort of swirl our way down into here. Yeah. Very, very steep. You would not want to fall down here. Sort of does give you the feeling of severe heights. Right. Not too sure if I've actually gone the right way now because it seems to be taking me sort of back up again. Wow. Um. Right, we need to go up and then down again. Okay, we're alright. It just is very up and down. That might be a quicker way back out though. Let's see now. Do I turn this way? 
Does so that text me back up? No, that looks like it text me back up. Doesn't look like it goes down again. So we're moving. I've never been bef here before, so this is quite cool. Quite pretty. Oh, we got the seats. Okay. Well, I just want to have a look around here because I've never been here before. This must be the green lobster claw plant Camilla was talking about. Okay, well, we've got it. I like in here. It's just really. It's really pretty. Kind of like eerie, beautif eerie eerily beautiful. There's lots more of those plants that she was talking about. Right, I suppose we'll head up and out of here. I think I saw like a slightly easier way to get out if it's not too steep. We might be able to use it rather than having to go the whole way around again. But I'm not too sure. We'll have to see when I get there. I literally rode the entire way out of here and then realised that I wasn't supposed to because I hadn't finished collecting the plant. Camilla said I need to be extra careful when picking the seeds from the plant. You get ready to pick the seeds from the pods from the green lobster claw plant. Right, so now let's hope that I've done this right. Okay, I need three. There's some more over there. Nope, can't go that way. Hold on. I wonder if I can jump. Swim across. Oh, well done, did you kick? Okay, we need one more. Seems to be wide enough that you can kind of run and jump it, so. Or swim it, almost. Nope, not gonna make it that time. What did we do wrong? Oh, wait, we can walk around here. Maybe. <laughs> uh, close enough. Right now. Oh, wait, we need to talk to the plant here. There we go, that should be enough. You're happy with your harvest and start to think about leaving when you hear a strange noise. I don't want to hear a strange noise. You hear a sound from the cave. Should you take a closer look? Um, I'm not really sure. Okay, okay, we'll, we'll be fearless. Digikick's not afraid of anything. Are you Digikick? Okay, what's over here? Ooh, what is that? Alberta, is that you? What are you doing here? Why would Alberta- <gasps> Get out of here! No. That's definitely not Alberto. Your gut feeling tells you this is bad. Yeah. It tells me it's pretty bad. <gasps> oh, there's loads of them! Oh god. Ooh. No, we're not doing this. Ooh. No, no, don't stop! Don't stop now, this is a terrible time to stop. They're closing in! Go! Ooh. I want to look behind me, but I don't see him time. <laughs> okay, I learned my lesson. Don't look behind. Just run, okay? Just get out of here. We're not dealing with this. We're not dealing with these spiders. Oh God. I can't even see when see them when they come out of nowhere. Oh okay, okay, okay. Oh my god, I don't know where I'm going. I'm never gonna get out of here alive. They're gonna find my corpse. It's gonna have been eaten by spiders. Right. Uh, right, okay, third time lucky we can do the standard kick. We can escape these eight legged things. They're eight legged demons. Right, come on. 
Pay attention, pay attention, pay attention. Okay, that was... That kind of worked, though. I think they, they've gone already. So that was sort of effective. Ooh. Oh, no, no, no. We're not, we're not doing this. We're not doing this. Why is there so I'm never coming back here ever again. I don't care if it's pretty. No, don't, don't stop. They're pursuing us. Go. Oh, no, there's more. Oh. Right, so we're getting out of here. We're getting out of here. We're getting out of here. Uh. I don't know where I'm supposed to go now. I don't know where they are, and I don't know. Am I going the right way? Oh, I only have a couple seconds left to do this. I'm gonna feel this. I want to do this again because I can't find. No, I don't want to start again. Right, we're getting out of here. We are getting out of here. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go, but we are gonna get out of here somehow. Uh, I see you. Don't even try it. Oh, right. No, 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 no. Right, come on. Ooh, not a chance. Almost fell to our deaths. Was that a lookout spiders for the previous spiders or for new spiders? I'm not sure. No, there's more, there's more, there's more. Right. These aren't getting me, these aren't getting me. Don't care what I have to do. Right. I need to see where this next arrow goes because I don't know where it is. Right, there's one there. There. Then where? Is it there? Okay, there it is. Right, we're going the right way now. Right, we can get out of here. Thank God. Ooh, right. <sighs> Let's go back to that vet. Phew, you did it. Best to write a hands camp now and tell camp and tell him now. Tell him everything now. He's not gonna care what I went through for his spider. The things I had to go through for this. So much trauma. There you are. Thank goodness you made it. Did you get the seed pods? What's happened? You look like you've seen a ghost. It's a lot worse than a ghost. Your reputation among the residents of crowds at Moon Village is improvement. New reputation is now light. Okay. Oh, I didn't think of that. Silly me. It's the time of year that the Jorvik and giant spiders come out to let, let, let their eggs hatch. They stay around the cauldron because it's nice and warm for them there. Sorry for forgetting to mention that, Jarislava. You got the seed pods. Anyway, hmm, I wonder. Jarislava, could you please send feed some of the fruits from the seed pods to Alberta while I try to take a blood sample from her? You are got to be kidding me. You sent me to a spider infested swamp and then you want me to feed a spider. You got to be joking. Can I just do it from here? Can I reach her from here and not have to go near her? There we go. Don't have to go up near her. We're not doing that. There we are. Now I've got a blood sample from Alberta. It'll not take long to get a result from this. If you just wait for a short while, we'll see if my suspicions are correct. Eep! Exactly as I thought, Jarislava. When you told me about the spiders, the cauldron, and about their eggs, I started to think that perhaps Alberta wasn't sick. And I was right. She's expecting eggs. Um, Hedden, I've never seen you smile before. You look almost scary. Ha! <laughs> I'd love to stay, but I need to get back now. I'll be back later to check on about her. Make sure she gets plenty of food and rest now. It's difficult to say when exactly she'll be ready to lay her eggs. Now I've really got to go. Lovely to meet you, Dragoslava. Bye. You're leaving me here? You've got to be kidding me. Don't believe this. There's gonna be more of them. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm going to be a granddad. Congratulations. Dragoslava, don't you get it? I'm going to be a granddad. Alberta, you're going to be a mother. My little sweetie is all grown up. 
Of course, by the way, this isn't a present, just in case you start getting an idea. I got delivered to my address by mistake and the young man at the post office wouldn't let me return it to kids these days. There you go. Yes, well, it does go rather, it rather seems as though Alberta likes you. Now, she sees a little peace and quiet, but I'll let you know when the eggs arrive. No, no, I'm good. But what did I get? I got cool terrain trousers. They're kind of, they're kind of cool. I'll put those on. I don't want to go near your spider, though. I'm good. Anyway, guys, I will leave it there. I hope you love it. Bye.